there are different techniques and tricks used to convert a PDF into Word. Here we have shortlisted three different methods which are useful in order to convert the CIE past papers into a new Word file where the teachers can create their worksheets for the later usage. So coming to the first method, it involves no downloading or subscription. What you have to do is first you have to save those past papers into a local folder of your computer and then you will come to a website which is called pdf2docx.com as you can see the exact website address and this address bar. Now click on this green button that says upload files and I have already saved some past papers in a folder from where I click on one of these papers and click open. Here you can see it is already uploading and it is converted online into another document. Now it says that it has been converted. Just click on this download. Now I have opened the same document from the same folder and when I click on it, as you can see, it is now opened in the MS Word and it is not in the PDF. First of all, click on this enable editing. Now this is an editable page from where you can make corrections in the same page or you can uh, copy it into a new document. Let's suppose we copy this question one, we make it control C and then we come into a new document and we will paste this question over here on go to the blank document and then having control V you can see that question has been pasted. In the second method you need to install a software from the internet that is called Foxhead Reader. As you can see on the screen when you download its latest version we open our past paper into this. Here it is already showing some past papers. I have clicked on one. And what you need to do is, as you can see, there is the second tab after home that is called convert. Then you will move to this sixth or seventh tab that says to MS Office. And then click on the first option that says to Word. When you click on it, it will start converting. But first it will ask you where to save it. Save the paper and then its conversion will start. Now it is automatically opened into a Word file where it is again editable in the same way as we have seen in the first technique. The third and final method is the most easiest one but it needs you to have at least 2013 version of MS Office or MS Word. If you have this 2013 version installed on your computer then the very simplest way is go into the file and open and select your PDF and it will be directly imported into the MS Word in the same way which is editable. Here it is. It is opened in the same way as it was seen in the PDF. Now you can edit the paper right into this ed page also but if you want to copy it uh, like we come to the page number two you can control C to copy it and then we move, move back to the page where we are creating our worksheet and here we can paste our question number three. Here it is. You can keep it as it is or you can amend it with your new lines as we are writing solve with two examples. And that's it. Using one of these three techniques, you can easily convert your past papers into your worksheets which have updated question and changed values. Thank you.